Oh, alrighty. Hello. Game. Game time. Whoa, nice purple jar, bro. The fuck? Alright, yeah, we're having a party. I forgot. We still need to figure out lighting, music, and something to write on that banner. If we're gonna die, we should have some fun first. Music? But Lewis isn't here. I'm gonna pick a color. Wouldn't be a party without some kind of mood light. Pink, 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 pink. Green's calming, but purple might be nice. That's pink. Well, purple was my dad's favorite color. Clementine dad based confirmed. Royalty. Well, yeah, yeah. Really. Problem? You got an issue? Shouldn't you like it too, Violet? It destroyed. I'll make it happen. So you take one of those black things that look like plates and you put it on here. And then it plays music? Yeah. Pulled out the old headmaster's gramophone so he could play some records. Not much of a selection. Jazz, 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 jazz. Wouldn't happen to have any good jazz records, would you? Oh, yeah. The old music teacher was a big fan. Good, cool. Pretty cool guy up until he ditched us all. Well, What's can you blame him? Like? Uh, well, that one's hard to describe. Mm, just wait till you hear it. Are we using All right, banner, banner. As a kind of party theme? Mm, wow, that not looks not like exactly. curtains, but it's meant to be more motivational. I'd keep it short, though. There's not as much room as you think. I was thinking something <laughs> uplifting, like we're gonna get through this. AJ, why don't you come up with something? Yeah, really? kid. What problem? It'll be a surprise. Ah, uh, please don't surprise me. <laughs> it's gonna be like I got Marlin in big red letters. This place is gonna look great. But why am I on making all the decisions? I'm not the party fearer. Like, oh, well, didn't other people do things? Oh. He's up in Marlin's office. He said he had a surprise for the party. Oh he no! Show it to you first. Oh no! I don't like surprises. <laughs> what is this? Hey Clem, check it out. I found a bunch of books on ships. Oh no. There's some awesome stuff about fires at sea and explosions and stuff. Oh no. He is the boiler. All right. Wait, what are you talking about? Sinking a ship. I have an idea about how to stop those assholes coming back to the school after we've rescued the others. And from hurting anyone else ever Well, again. you wouldn't be kind of just killing them the all. Boat. But, like, the there's more of them. Make sure they don't come back. Besides, it feels right, you know? <laughs> Could kill us all. Mitch, I don't want to uh, discourage you, but we're going to be on that boat to rescue the others. Please, don't get us killed. What? No! I mean, yeah... I I still have a few details to work out. Oh God, we're all gonna die! It's time for you to get off the boat before she explodes. Yeah. Trust me, this will work. We'll be okay. Okay, everybody, get ready to boogie. Yeehaw. And um, Clem, I'm sorry for before, about how I treated Ten. I don't really care. I don't mean to get so angry. I know it's not his fault. That's nice, Willie, but don't tell me. Tell ten. Wall. All right. Sounds more like country to me, but whatever. Can we please take that stupid gold chain off the dog? It looks fucking ridiculous. <laughs> Here, this is for you, explodes. Wow, this looks great, Ruby. Couldn't have done it without you. But just wait till you see what else I've got planned. Go ahead and mingle. I'll let you know when it's time. Okay, I'll I guess mingle. I'll mingle? I'm mingling. Whoa. I see you two are working together. Yeah, Willie asked me to help with his special project. Making bombs and. Good to hear. A dark Is room. It ready? Good to go, Clem. It'll work. Actually, ah, uh, I was thinking maybe we should name it something cool. I mean, like, I think it deserves the a name. Bomb. Yeah, we absolutely have to name it. 
I thought you'd make fun of me, but hell yeah. Let's name this fucker. Whoa, swearing. <laughs> Rawr. Mitch's masterpiece. Yeah. I like yeah. that. Mitch would have too. Okay, of course he would have. Settled. Wow, mingling sucks. <laughs> I found them. What do you find? Your okay, report cards? Clementine. These here are our official <laughs> and psych evaluations and probationary reports. Nice. Okay. I don't get it. Well, these explain Awesome. All I want to I want to read this stuff. Place. And all the bad shit we did that kept them from sending us back home. So what's the game? I figured if we're all going on this crazy mission together, we might as well know who we really are. Can't wait to not ever trust so any of I'll you read again. Some of what the adults thought about us, and you have to guess which one of us fits the bill. I'll make sure it's someone you've actually met. This will be the first one. While otherwise a remarkable student, blank. Continues to be plagued by fits of anger, uncontrollable cursing, and repeated physical altercations with the senior faculty. Yeah, that could be fucking anyone. It's definitely not that. Uh, probably Violet. It's then. gotta be Violet. Nope, way oh. scarier. All right, who the fuck That's is it? Then? File. Oh shit. Oh, shit, really? Guilty as charged. She seems yeah, to have grown out of it. I've seen Ruby back in the early days. She was like, uh, you ever seen those Tasmanian devil cartoons in your life? Uh, sure, I guess. <laughs> that was our Ruby. We used to have a mean streak a mile long. <laughs> Don't worry. That was a long time ago. I mean, I can totally see it. Well, <laughs> no, I can't. I Ruby, she was all, that little motherfucker. <laughs> I said I was sorry. Shut up. I don't care. You guys want to know why I got sent here? Willie, please. No. Chronic masturbation. <laughs> what? You're like seven years old. Trust me. Nobody wanted to know that. Cool. What does that mean? Uh, uh, don't you dare. God damn it. <laughs> Uh, anyway, <laughs> sincere concern. Oh, well, I thought kind of different music. I think there's a lot of them. All right, fine. Let's We've switch it to this. this. Put on the classical stuff. <sighs> All right. Anyway. What? Who's next? Oh. I didn't realize how many of us. Yeah, are. wow. There's a lot of people that I'm not. Justin guy. And Theresa and Jasper. Ah, and yeah. One yeah. girl with colored braces. Yeah. And Joey, George. Maddie, yeah. Lamar. Fred. Mike. Yeah, I used to make fun of her braces. Yeah, and then there was uh, Gibraltar. Dewey, yeah, yeah, mm hmm Holy crap, how many of us died? 34. Cool, That's, none of this means anything to me. I hope you realize this game. Whose is it? Lewis. Ah. Should we read it? I could tell you why I was sent here instead. You know, as a consolation prize or whatever. Uh. Uh, fine. Hate me after, but since we're all being so well, we're all gonna die anyway. This fucking jackass masturbator wants to explode. I was hoping you'd tell me. I spent a lot of time at my grandma's house growing up, what with my dad being a drunk and my mom working three jobs. <clears throat> but after my grandpa died, grandma just kind of shut down. Spent all day and night rocking in her little chair in the den. I'd sit there at her feet as we both watched TV. Mostly cartoons, since she never seemed to care. Sometimes I could hear her crying, but I didn't look back. I'd just feel really weird and turn up the volume. You know? Anyway, cool. one day she left the den, and 
came back with another chair and a 22 rifle. Set the rifle butt on the top of the chair, holding the barrel back to her chest. What? So, you know, she had trouble reaching the trigger this way, but she must have known it would happen because she took out this really tacky wooden back scratcher, the real long kind with the one end shaped like a hand, and uh, used that to push Man, it. your grandma is stupid. So, yeah. Bang. Right. You could totally do that. I'm just I'm just saying, like, you could totally pull that off. Your grandma sucks. Bad at suicide. Hours later, I hadn't moved. She asked why I didn't call the police or an ambulance or anything. Why would you? I shrugged and told her it wasn't like grandma was going anywhere. Oh my god. And besides. All right, psychopath. Cool. Anyway. Way to really kill the mood. You even killed she the record player. The next day. <laughs> I was 11. <laughs> uh, sure, yeah, so let's sorry, be man. nice. I can't Why not? imagine what that was like. What you went through. It's fine. We've just been through a lot of shit. I haven't. We I was great. People. I but never expected this. I think you're all busy. By the people that were supposed to take care of. Us. Well, they had their own families to look after. You and consider it asshole. Be fun. I'm, I'm just not the game type like Lewis was, I guess. You mean is? Yeah. See him soon. Ten's right. Hey, I've got an idea. Of course you do. You guys remember when Minnie? Would sing us Don't Be Afraid. Um, All no, songs. no, I don't. Can't say I do. Lou would have known how. He liked that one. You could just sing it to us, like she used to. Your voice is really pretty. <sighs> okay, yeah. All right, I, uh, I can do that. I'll be leaving the room now. Also, the record player turned off like completely on its own, I just want to say, like, a while ago. That's a loud-ass candle. Oh, wow. Dramatic. Yeah. Sure, it's totally not like that was completely unprompted from AJ. No, yeah, fuck it. Whatever. I don't care. Oh, hey, we're back with Lee era. And the train. Hey there, Lee. I missed having a sane adult in the building. Lee? Did they remaster his face? He looks Why different. Train? You always pick the train. I'm not sure. Maybe because this is where it all started. Did they remaster I your face too, Clementine? And to cut my hair. To be ready for what was coming. So we're consulting with Lee in our mind. A quick study. So, what's on your mind this time? I'm worried, Lee. I've got a lot of people depending on me, and I don't know if what I'm doing is right. <laughs> oh, I know that feeling. <laughs> yeah, Lee was the only was competent a human person. As it went along, right? Couldn't let on, of course. With you being so little. I never noticed. It just felt like you always knew the right thing to do. He was gaming. Yeah. Well, I got lucky. Luck counts for a lot. I'm gonna need some now. You wanna tell me about what you're up against? I'm with a new group now. And I've been in so many. And they always fall apart. But I really like this one. It's different. It almost feels like home. Ugh. That's a good thing. It's hard being alone out there. But we're in trouble. 
Some bad people captured my friends, and getting them back might get the rest of us killed. I'm not worried. Hmm. <laughs> what? Whatever trouble you in, you get out of it. You get your friends out of it. Yeah. You don't know that. Yes, I do. I know you're a survivor. The Clementine I know is gonna fix it. I really believe that. You're right. I just needed to hear you say it. I'm going to get my friends out of this. Every one of them. Alive. That's right. Well, that's not probably that's entirely what true. Is gonna say when he sees your face. Those boys are gonna have hope again knowing that you came to rescue them. That would be oh, really funny if it now I just control the Lee instead. <laughs> Play the first season again. Before you charged into that mess at McCarroll Branch, you survived that, didn't you? That was different. I was alone. I know. It's harder when you have something to lose, but having people you care about—that's a good thing. Friends, a girl. Who loves you? They're fighting beside you because of you. Cool. Come see me again when you've gotten them out, okay? Out and safe. Yeah, good talk, Lee. Sound good. And hopefully we can talk about happier things. Lee, I miss you. So much. I wish you were really here. <laughs> He'd be like 60, but yeah. It would I miss be, you too, Clementine. It would be super fucking but funny to make do with if he was alive and then we just <laughs> Lily on him. Is he fucking me. destroy Lily? You always makes me feel a little bit better. I meant to ask. How's the boy? He's good, Lee. You'd like him. I bet. You teach him to shoot yet? A long time ago. <laughs> you have no idea. I guess the world got pretty hard since I left it. A kid growing up in it, <laughs> he'd be hard too. <laughs> You're in my shoes now, raising a kid. Think you got a handle on it? Nope. Uh, it can't be easy. Want to give him a childhood, but you'd be so proud of now. EJ's amazingly. I've taught him to be strong and brave and capable. He's an idiot, but he's doing he's good. So proud. You mean more than I already am. Ah, uh, you word twisting asshole. <laughs> you always were a prick. But that's just how I made you. Time to go. Wow. Just look at you. <laughs> Just look at you. Oh, wow, yeah, she's really small. <laughs> like four foot one. <laughs> Thought I told you to keep this short. Um, you don't know how hard it is to find scissors these days. <laughs> Time to go, Clementine. All right. You've got people that need you. <laughs> Is he just gonna fade into the shadow? <laughs> Is that a graphical <laughs> error or step by design? Because <laughs> it just looks really funny. <laughs> He's been assimilated by the void. No. Wake up. It's time to go. All right. We bought a ball. We got a long walk. Hmm, that guy has some nice skin. Uh. 
his beautiful face. They had a spotlight on that, they would have totally seen that. I guess we're really doing this. Only the team blending in with the walkers need to cover themselves. Now we just need your walker friend to... He's here. Good lord. Uh, <laughs> hello. Hi. Guys, this is James. He's my friend. <laughs> He's, uh, so cool. <laughs> you get the skin like that. Uh, oh, I, um... Clementine? Can I try it on? That's not a good idea. Uh, Come on, please. Yeah, on, ease up, ease up. Face. We'll do it after. We'll do I it after. Not right now. <laughs> yeah, right. All now. right. Sorry. I didn't mean to be weird or anything. It's okay. Oh, and sorry I tried to shoot you that one time. Your mask looks so real. <laughs> I uh, uh, hey, hey there, James. Sorry about Willie. Is this the guy that Clem said she'd marry? Hey man, you're a hater. <laughs> yeah. Um, Clementine, could I speak to you alone <laughs> for a moment? Good idea. <laughs> Hold tight. Hey Tank, can you come talk for a sec? There's something I have to tell you. <laughs> you're stupid. The walkers. They'll be here in a little while. You can join them as they pass through the trees. The noise from the boat will draw them toward the water. All right. Then we can get on board and save our friends. Your friends are different, open-minded, accepting. <laughs> I think it's just because I've been talking you up like crazy. Man, shut up! You're molding. Listen, Clementine. I need to talk to you about AJ. Oh no, he's stealing mean? my son. The Whisperers or my family. From a young age. In that time I witnessed a lot of death and suffering. Eventually I became the cause of it. Cool. Weakness was considered a poison. And I believed in that fiercely. So much so. That when another boy expressed sympathy for our enemy before an attack. You murked his ass. ass. <laughs> cool dude. I didn't talk to him. Didn't consider who he was. What he felt. Yeah. What's your point, James? After he died, I kept hearing his words in my head. Those people are like us. Just on a different path. I stopped so? killing after that. I changed. No one else did. When AJ told me he killed someone, it reminded me of them. Cool. Of myself. When he said it was the right thing to do. Taking life like that from a young age, it breaks something inside you. Uh huh. Man, listen, you're a cool I dude. Just, I'm afraid if AJ kills again, I'm just he like, won't be able to go back. You keep handing down life he lessons, and I don't care. Was. I'm not going to let AJ become a killer. I don't want him to change. Not like that. I hope you can keep that promise. That's not a promise. I'm just saying it. I didn't promise shit. They're close. Dumbass. Soon there will be enough of them to provide us cover. I'll lead you through the herd until you reach the boat. And then I'll die. As as I go. After that, it's up to you. Cool. Thank you. Uh huh. Take care of AJ. Nah. Okay, he's ready to go. The walkers are getting close. Ruby, you're in charge of the horses. Willie, Dan, take care of the supplies. I've got the bomb. The bomb. Find the boiler. There'll be a door on the bottom with ash and stuff. Put it in there. They'd better not kill all of us. That would really suck. See you all on the other side. Lol. We're all gonna die. I'll cut it open. What's up?
Violet told me about Minnie. Ah. That Sophie died, and Minnie is one of them now. Yep. Just, if you see her out there, tell her, tell her I forgive her. Fair enough. Please. I tell her myself, but. Yeah. I just want her to be okay. Can do that. Yeah, sure. If we see her, I'll let her know. Thanks. Hello, Vylord. Whoa! <laughs> Clementine's having a bit of a teleportation spasm. Hey, it's time. We gotta move. Clem? Yeah. What happens if someone else gets caught while we're in there? Well, then we, like, I don't know. We come back again. What if it's you? So? Don't care. I couldn't save Minnie or Lou or a Sim. Omar. And? I, I, I fail how to see, like, I, really I fail to see how this is, like, relevant at all. If something happened to you because of me. Oh, how is this because of you? This is my idea, I my plan. I'm me. doing all the work. How the fuck is this your fault? Shut I up. Mean, just shut up. Stop talking. Anything for you to just shut the hell up. Not disappear on me, okay? <laughs> yeah, just steal the boat. <laughs> just flee to Mexico. <laughs> what are you doing? What do you mean? What? Look in another direction. Explaining gay people. Are we good? Yeah, I think so. Cool. Okay, let's bring our friends back home. All of them. All None of them. of them. Everyone dies now. It's ready. Yay, time for gut. So, I know this is gonna sound gross, but... Covering your smell. <laughs> Smart. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, you're never gonna have be able to wear these clothes again, because this shit's gonna smell worse than it does already. And it probably smells terrible. Shit hasn't been washed in like a year. At Give least. <laughs> Do I have an option here, Telltale, or are you just giving me prompts so that I feel like I'm participating? Thanks. No problem. Well, I don't see any other choice. We're doing it. Let's do it. Uh, I said we're gonna do it next time. So peace out, gang.